Right, good morning, good morning, good morning. It's David Global Preppers Network or Urban Prepper UK on YouTube. Um, thanks to all the people that have had a look at my uh, go back video. That's still up. Um, as promised, I've got four or five videos in the process and this is one of them. Okay, this is the ration packs, the UK versus the um, US ones. Okay, uh, so we're just going to be opening them, having a look at the contents of them and have a little chat about them. Let's go and have a look. Okay, right, we've got a whole box of uh, US ones here, and I've got a couple of the UK ones over there, like there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick one out of here. Menu two, be shredded in barbecue sauce. And we've got the menu two, uh, menu two from the UK one. Let's have a look at these. Right, first of all, notice the size difference. These American ones are one meal, where the UK ones are like 24 hour. So, hence the size difference. So you're probably gonna need three of these to make up for one of these, apparently. But we'll have a look what's inside anyway, because people are interested what's inside them. I have done a previous video opening a ration pack, which is a menu four, I think. But yeah, that was a long time ago, which a lot of people haven't seen, so. Let's get these open and have a look what's inside. Right, here we are, sat back down the old bones. Right, so we've got the, as said, menu two and menu two. Right, first of all, I'm gonna open the, uh, the UK one because it's a bigger one. So this is for 24 hours, obviously. My trusted knife, this is favorite knife I got. Uh, Milwaukee, uh, Hardline. Great knife, about 40 quid, it's lasted me years. There you go. There we go. Okay, right, so first of all, okay, I'm gonna lay, oh, there you go. I'm gonna lay all this down anyway. So we've got our uh, little tea caddy thing here, which we'll go through in a second. Oh, uh, what well, that says on it. Pindi Chano Alu, which is some type of curry thing. Okay, we'll have a look. I mean, the thing is with these UK ones is that they have lots of stuff in. I mean, if, like I say, I saw my last video. If you took one of these out, because I've got, I've actually got this menu in um, in my uh, go bag that I put on yesterday. So, like, I mean, you'll see why I said these could last you a few days, if not a week. Okay, so, right, so what else we got in here? We got a couple of packs. I'm going to go through all this. I'm just going to take it out and then I'm going to lay it out and we're going to go through it. Okay, it's a good one. Chili con carne, get in. Right, I think that is a lot. So I've been there, oh, there's something else in there. Oh, nougat. There we go. Sorted, right, clean that up after. Right, let's set this out and we'll go for it. Right, okay, I managed to get all the contents out of the UK one, and there's a lot, as you can see. We'll go for it, because I like to do it from top left down to bottom right. Okay, so you can see there's a lot of food here, and this is why I said that you could last a few days with this. Let's move my knife and my, uh, let's say, a survival guide, which is left on the table because I was looking at it yesterday. Right, let's have a look. So you've got a bar of nougat, or nugget, whatever it's called. This is the uh, uh, Pindi Chana Alu, which is some sort of curry, like I say. We've got chili con carne. We've got chicken, sausage, and beans. Okay, and we got cooked rice. Nice. I mean, there's a couple of days there on its own. Then we got cinnamon cake. Oatmeal block, which I think is a couple of like like really cheap hobnobby type biscuits, as if I remember. Now you've got a couple of energy drink powders there. Okay. So, a couple of tea bags. A couple of little things of coffee. Right, well, where are we now? Right. As I said in my bag yesterday, when we take this, for a couple of days, we've got tissues there, okay? And we've also uh, got the, if we come across here, antibacterial wipes, right? So anyway, so we've got hot chocolate, okay? Which again, can be broke down into two lots. All this can be shared over a couple of days. Salted peanuts. I mean, cheddar cheese flavored spread. I mean, that's gotta be repulsive, but I'm sure it's, uh, it would help. Right, and then you've got your antibacterial wipes, quite large ones. You've got your milk powder, 
you got four sugar, four milk powder, spoon, you got your stormproof, waterproof matches, you got six um what they call water purification tablets, you have got three strong mints, and what's that salt? Spicy chili sauce. Oh there you go. So I mean let's have just have a quick look around. Okay, so there you go. And hence this is why. I mean, you can go 24 days without food before you start like dying. So I'm pretty sure you could get by on this for a week. People in some countries get by on a lot less. So there you go. Okay, so that is the UK menu two one. Pretty impressive. I'm sure you'd uh, you'd agree. So let's go and have a look at this uh, meager little American one and see what happens. Okay, right, here's our American one. Right, as I think it's only fair, as the British one is meant to be 24 hours and this is meant to be one meal. Okay, I'm going to grab another couple of random ones out. Uh, maybe just one. And we'll have another look at another one and see if that even compares with the amount of food. So let's have a look in here. What we got? There you go. Chili and macaroni. Okay, so that's two. So hopefully, that's two good meals there. So let's have a look. Right, so we've had a look at the American one, uh, the UK one now, we'll have a look at the American menu too. Okay, right, these have got the flameless heaters in, which I'm not gonna use today, obviously, because I'm not gonna eat it today. But um, what we're gonna do is, uh, apparently that's a peelable seal. I don't think it is. There you go. So let's have a look inside. Okay, we'll take these out and do the same again, we'll go for it, okay? So, wow. Chili and macaroni. All right, here's your accessory pack. No size difference to UK one, because this is obviously like a half. Oh. Wow. Okay. One thing I have heard about the American ration packs is that they are much better quality food in there. I don't think there's as much, but it's like better quality. quality. And the ones I've tried from years ago seem to be a bit better as well. Let's have a look. Vanilla pound cake. Right, what have we got here? Teriyaki beef stick. You know, it's like being at a restaurant, isn't it? What have we got here? Cheese spread jalapenos. Here's your spoon. What else we got here? Okay, um, electrolyte orange powder. Oh, that's your um, ration heater. We don't need that at the moment. So let's have a look here. And what we got here? We have got vegetable crackers. And what's this for? That's for the macaroni and beef in sauce, it's a sleeve. Okay, so we'll, we'll lay this out and we'll have a look. Right, so let's have a look at the US one, and this is only one, we're gonna chuck the other one with it in a minute. So we've got the carbohydrate electrolyte beverage powder in orange, natural and artificial flavor. Nice. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's have a look. This is the chili and macaroni, which comes with a sleeve to hold it in. We have got some vegetable crackers. I mean, on all these, there's loads of ingredients for the preservation process, I'm sure. I mean, look at these little things. They're pretty cool, aren't they? Yeah. Cherry flavored sweets, I bet they are amazing. They're going in my uh, bag. Right, what have we got here? We got vanilla pound cake. We got teriyaki beef stick. Okay, and we got the little bits and pieces, same as the UK, crushed red pepper, we got matches, salt, we got a uh, creamer, we've got a little sachet of coffee, sugar. No. For one meal, pretty good. You know, I mean, yeah, pretty good. Right, what we're going to do, we're going to add the other one and I'm going to put it with it. Let's have a look. I've got the other one open now. Now it's looking a bit more like the uh, UK one. This is only two meals. Say so where the UK one's 24 hours. I'm starting to lean in towards this at the moment. Let's have a look through it. So we've got another electrolyte. So we've got two electrolyte powders, orange. We have got shredded beef and barbecue sauce, and we've got chili and macaroni. We've got vegetable crackers there. 
We have got black beans and soy sauce. We have got the Twizzler sweets, tortillas, plain tortillas. We got the vanilla pound cake and we got an oatmeal cookie. Look at that. We got the teriyaki beef stick. We got another pack of these, so I haven't opened them, so you get the idea. So we got two of these spreads and we got the other bits and pieces of coffee in there. So I mean, again, that's gonna get you through. Okay, the reason I don't use these is because literally what I do is I give these away to group members. Uh, when I open them for my YouTube, I give them away to group members. Uh, even though they're open, they're, all these are sealed. So, happy days. Right. Now, there you go. So, that's pretty much. I mean, make your own decisions what you prefer. I mean, I have tried them all before. Well, not all of them, but I've tried the American ones before. And I've tried the UK ones before. And like I said before, I think the... Uh, the American food quality seems better to me, to my personal taste, but um, the UK one seems to be like it can last longer. Do you know what I mean? I'm not sure about the nutritional value of this because like there's, uh, let's have a look at just this cake for instance. There you go, 270 calories. 270 calories. And the cookie, what's that? 280 calories, yeah. So let's have a look. There's no calorific value on any of the meals, just on the sweet stuff. So, yeah. I mean, grab one, try them. They're about 14 quid a, a thing, I think, at the moment. And the UK ones are similar. So, uh, and they last for years as well, obviously. I mean, this UK ones are dated 2019, and I would still be able to eat those in years. So, and they, I think these American ones are, it's like 19 to 22. So, loads of life still in these. Okay, right, let's get this away, sit down and have a chat. Right, so there you have it. The UK and the US one, or two US ones. Uh, make up your own mind. Decide which one you think is the better value or the better one for you. Um, but they are long-term storage and they're good things to have. Loads of preppers I know have them. Uh, you can get them from the prepper shop. You can get them from all over the place, military surface shops. Uh, have a look about. So it's uh, good stuff to store. Right, that is it. I mean, drop a comment on the uh, the video and uh, let us know what you think. Like I said on the previous video, I've got bits and pieces coming up. So you might see quite a few videos coming up in the next week or two. I've got the fire stove. I've got the soil filter. I've got the first aid kit. I've got the fire kit. Lots of bits and pieces going on. I'm trying to fit in training in between as well. So, right. It's been emotional. I'll catch you soon for the next video. Thanks for watching.